Hey everybody, it's Rico Go, and today I'm going to try the best street food here in Cyprus. But first of all, let's start from the beginning. I take the chicken burrito uh -huh. and a juice. Okay. And for me, it's the I want to try the acai protein bowl. Acai. Acai. Alright, good morning. We just arrived here in Limassol and now I will eat this acai protein bowl. As a breakfast it's just a little bit because later on of course we will eat so much more at the street food festival and we are also going to explore Limassol. So that's definitely going to be amazing and let's eat this and start the day. Alright, we just ate breakfast here in Limassol, meal number one, a smoothie bowl as well as a chicken burrito and now I really really desire a Freddo Espresso, so let's hop into the car and drive to of course Cafe Nero at the sea. Can I get one Freddo Espresso, please? And iced Americano with a little bit of coconut milk. Okay guys, it's one hour left until the street food festival now. We are here at the Limassol Promenade. It is so green here. It's really one of my most favorite places. And I kind of want to go into the water now, but I don't have my swimsuit with me. So I might just jump spontaneously into the water, enjoy this walk right here and show you this place of Limassol. It's really amazing. And then of course, it's food time. Thank you. <laughs> when I used to live in Limassol, I actually used to go to this gym here on a daily basis. It was really an amazing feeling to add this outdoor gym into my daily routine. Also today, I still have a gym in my basement. I'm just adding some workouts from time to time to my routine because I feel so much better with it. I can concentrate better, I feel more healthy. So yes, definitely add fitness to your daily routine. Yes, it is super hot, but it's also windy, so it feels kind of refreshing, and I like that. <clears throat> Why is the orange close? I want some orange juice. <laughs>
one of the best feelings during the day to just go into the water and have a nice refreshment it feels amazing I would love to just jump into the water now and be all covered just by water guys I said I want to go into the water so why am I just standing there with my feet I'm not a quitter I go all the way of course so I'm going into the water now I don't care just be confident <laughs> Guys, 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 that was fun, but even more fun will be the street food now, so let's go! Okay, we arrived at the Seaside Street Food Festival and it is really seaside i mean look at this amazing view and because i'm german i'm of course five minutes earlier and as i see i'm the first one <laughs> hello yes we are literally the first tickets here the first tickets in the bin Okay guys, I'm ready for the first street food. I think I need something to drink and I saw some Czech cold brew, so I will definitely drink that now. Hi, how are you? I would like to drink uh, your recommendation. Yeah, Popolsko. Czech Republic. Okay, it's similar. Bardzo <laughs> dobre. This is similar like Czech lager. Mm -hmm. Very special beer, this one. It's it's very light, it's not heavy. And you put it uh, blackberry syrup inside. It's, it's like, like lemonade. I will try the lager. Okay. And for her it's something sweet. It's gonna be sour, this one. It's not actually so sour when you put it in the Okay, we'll do it like this. I don't think it's sweet. Very good. Lager beer from Prague, Czech. I like it. Let's try this out. He said that I will not recognize that it is beer. Okay, he's right. It's super fruity and this definitely tastes like beer. Ah, it's good but not together. <laughs> Really? Your nice to meet you. How are you? I'm fine. You? Yes. What are you doing here? We are a startup company. Okay. Let me treat you something. Okay. Would you like lemonade? We have. Hi. How are you? Hi. Nice hi. To meet you. Nice to meet you. We are a startup selling fresh frozen herbs. It's a really innovative product in the market. And we have. And we're demonstrating our product in our, in our food. We have. A, Croissant with prawns in it. It's a really nice. Let me treat you one. Okay, sounds good. 
So wait, you are the founders? Yes. Yes. Really? The six. The six. It was our idea. Yes. Yeah, we started from a school competition. And where is the production? In the Cosia. Yes. yes. Okay, that's cool. We I like small, it. We have a small line of production. I have never seen something like this. It's cool. And you are... Uh, Bootstrapped or you have VC money like investors? No, we are. Huh? We are investors. Completely on your own. No investors. No, no. Okay. Just it's our lemonade with our special basil syrup. Okay. Very good. I like it. Obima? Amazing. Really good. Yeah. I'm so uh, happy that you liked it. Like, for real, this is very refreshing. Yes. I can imagine myself drinking it in the summer. Yeah, really, this is our syrup. It's basil, it's, good. it's our production. So it's not this? No, we have two products. Uh, herbal cubes and the basil syrup. Okay. This is a black uh, carbon croissant. Wow. With corns, avocado, chili mayo with truffle. Let me try. Nice. Nice. I'm really happy that you liked it. No, I like it really. If I don't like something, I say it, but I like it. <laughs> it's fresh and also like a little bit of a sushi taste. Yes. So it's a good mix of everything. I think it's a very nice summer snack and summer drink as well. I wish them all the best and now we continue our walk. And guys, thank you very much. Nice to meet you. Thank you very much. If you need anything, let me know. <laughs> Okay, now we are going to check out the pot belly. Hey, what's up? Hello, man. Nice to meet you, nice to see you. Thank you. The pot belly, what does it mean? The pot belly, well, it came out of a magnificent idea to slowly cook the pork, the pig. Slowly cooked in the oven for eight hours and then carefully pulled with special spices. Then let's try it out. I don't eat pork that often, so when I eat it, I'm excited. It's gonna taste really awesome. So burger from pork belly, let's uh, pot belly, not pork belly. It's pork, but it's called pot belly. It's hot, but uh, I think it's good. I haven't tasted a burger like this. It's a very unique taste. Very good. It's juicy. It's much different than a patty. It's very juicy. The meat itself cannot be dry. I want to try it again. It's very juicy and like super tasty actually. I like it. I can't get enough. I want more. Okay, now I think it is time to be a German, a little bit of a German and eat German bratwurst because I saw there is a German bratwurst. It's actually right here. So let's try it out. Hello. Nice to meet you. The Germans would like to eat a German bratwurst. <laughs> One, please. You want the pepperoni or the original? Let's make it original. Original? Thank you. With the... Yes, please. One original bratwurst. Perfect, thank you. All right, let's try this out. All right, so we got the German bratwurst with all sauces. And also what I recognize a lot is that when people recognize me, they say that like, I say the truth and I like that because I always want to say the truth in my videos. So if you enjoy that, definitely make sure to subscribe to the channel.
All right, guys, time for the German Bratwurst. Actually, I'm German, but I don't eat German things and I also don't drink German things because I don't drink beer that often. It's not my type of stuff. And also Bratwurst, I don't know, it's like, you can eat it, but it's not the first choice of mine. Anyways, I definitely know how German Bratwurst tastes like, so let's see if this is on the level. Yeah. Why is everything so tasty here today? Like really, everything is so tasty today. Like everything I drink and eat today is amazing. This as well. Mm. The onions and the sauce. Again, so juicy, I love it. Hey man, how are you? You definitely win the design award. You have the best stand, it looks the best. <laughs> I would love to eat a burger, but I ate one already and I think uh, I need to try something else now. Maybe even something sweet, like waffles, crepe. And here they have bao buns. It's something Asian. I like to eat it actually. It's like little burgers, but again, I want something different. Here I feel like home, it's München, it's a German city. I think this is the most local stand here. Yes, definitely. Here they have all kinds of local cuisines. And biscuits. Oh, and here they have Italian pizza. I'm actually a fan of pizza. I might go with the pizza now. Authentic Neapolitan pizza under two minutes. All right, let's do that. I might go with pepperoni. I watch you on TikTok. Yes, I hear this a lot. I actually live in Paphos, but I'm always surprised by how many people know me from Limas or Larnaca. It's, 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 uh, it's unbelievable. No, the TikTok is like. Um, it's it's amazing marketing for sure. Best, uh, it's the next thing. I What's your name? Leo. All right, Leo. Listen. Nice uh, I would love to have a pepperoni. We will go somewhere else and come back in 10 yeah, minutes to yeah. pick it up. All right, pizza time. I'm amazed by how multicultural the street food here is. I mean, we have pizza, we have Asian food, we have German food. And this is what I like because I like a lot of different tastes. And tonight I'm going to test out everything. So far everything is good. This pizza just took one minute to finish. Let's see if it can satisfy me. I think yes. Okay. More vanilla ice cream with Kelbo basil. Okay. Try it. Perfect as a desert. You can take one vanilla and one lemon if you want. We take one. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you very much. I have to. Amazing. All right, guys. I'm literally so full but i really enjoyed everything and i hope that you enjoyed the video and if you subscribe to the channel i will see you in the next video <laughs>